Hey, it's Ryan here. I got some hot sauces we're gonna check out and I made up some chicken thighs and chicken legs the other night. So just gonna heat these up and check out these hot sauces. So first up what we have is Tapatio sauce picante. One of the things that I do like about this one is there is no vinegar in it. I'm not a huge vinegar fan when it comes to my hot sauces. This one here is fantastic. It came from Maui, it's called the Dobo Loco and it's a Hawaiian hot sauce, pineapple hot sauce. It says, open, pour, feel it, repeat. And it's absolutely fantastic. Can't remember if there is any vinegar in it. No, I don't see any vinegar in it, it's just straight up. Oh yeah, pineapple, apple cider vinegar, habanero powder, sea salt, and garlic powder. It's fantastic, especially on chicken. Then I've got my triple X hot sauce, and it's chili habanero by El Yacateco. Fantastic. If you want some good heat and really good flavor, this is definitely a go-to. This one here came out of St. John's, Newfoundland, if I'm not mistaken. It's called Maritime Madness, and it's absolutely crazy. Water, vinegar, peppers. It's got habanero, Carolina Reaper in it. Some fresh garlic, some salt, and xanthan gum for stabilization of product. But ultimate giver sauce. Maritime Madness Canadian made pepper sauce. It's the ultimate giver sauce. And this one is fantastic. It's really hot, gluten free. And this baby here comes in this little grenade flashbang. Came from the Pepper Palace. This is the hottest hot sauce that I've ever had in my life. And uh, in order to try it out inside the store, you actually had to sign a waiver because it could kill you or something. So ingredients are habanero peppers, vinegar, tomato paste, uh, ola resin capsicum, jalokia peppers, so that's the ghost pepper, Carolina reaper, scorpion peppers as well, Carolina reaper peppers, garlic, onion, salt, citric acid, and xanthan This stuff here you definitely don't want to get on your fingers and then stick it in your eye because uh, Speaking from experience. All right, so first one I'm gonna try up is the Tapatio. I'll just use a piece of chicken leg here and get it right in there. I'm not shy, I'm not too proud. So Tapatio is up first. Just like, kind of like the last dab here. I take the whole dab that I got. All right. Mm. Mm. Damn, that's good chicken. Chicken's got some spice on it too, but Top deal, definitely the go-to uh, when it comes down to hot sauces for chili, for just about everything. It's fantastic. All right, next up, we got the Adobo Loco. <clears throat> Again, that one's got a little bit of snap to it too. So I'm trying to scoop all this up or coat it. Mm, oh my God. Mm. Excuse me. Just like Maui right off the hop. <laughs> Unbelievable. I went back for more. Mm. So good. Next up, we got the El Yacateco. Might be able to make it there with most of this. One leg here. Okay, so the El Yacateco, we're gonna come in from both sides on this. Get a bunch. Mm. Oh my God, so good. That sauce there, got a little bit of vinegar to it, got a little bit of snap. It's really hot, but the flavor is there. It's nice and smoky and just fantastic. Okay, next up, we got the ultimate giving her sauce, and I know it's gonna be really hot, so let's get right into that one. That's this red one here. Oh, that's gonna be hot. Mm. Oh yeah. Ooh, here comes the heat. Oh, that's that reaper coming through. Mm. Yeah, finally got some heat. These ones here, for most people, I'd say are really hot. This one's the weakest, and then I went from the weakest to the hottest as we go down the list here. Um, the Adobo Loco might be just a little bit ahead of this guy, or, or pretty darn close when it comes down to it. But this Carolina Reaper, whew, 
It's good. I've got a little bit of sweat going here, but I'm not going to stop. So don't like me to stop. This one here is potentially fatal. Oh, I want a little bit of that skin too, man. Skin's good stuff. This one here, you gotta use so sparingly. I've actually got it on a toothpick right now, and I'm gonna spread it on there just so you can see. That, to most, no disrespect, most white guys can't handle the heat, but uh, this stuff here, this is going to be insane. I don't even want to touch the rest of that. That's how hot this stuff is. Okay. Put a little skin flap over there. <sighs> Bottoms up. Mmm. Mmm. That flashbang's got such good flavor. Hold on, I'm just going to wash my hands here real quick. <clears throat> oh yeah, here comes the flashbang. It's coming hot. It's coming hard. Ooh, and it lasts. I know it lasts. <clears throat> Whew. Definitely not going to hit it with water. Water just spreads it around. Makes it even hotter. Intensifies it. Mmm. A little bit of sweat coming. Mm. Just gotta work through the pain. Pain is an illusion. That's hot. Definitely what I use this one for, this flashbang, I don't even wanna touch the bottle right now. Uh, but the flashbang, it's hot. And it's so good, just a little tiny bit of that for a pot of chili, I take a toothpick and dunk it in and I'll dunk the toothpick up to about here. And it makes that whole pot of chili nuclear. So it's fantastic. We gotta give her a little, excuse me, nose wipe on that one. Well, I don't know if it's gonna kick in any more than this. This is pretty, pretty intense, but yeah, she's coming. She's hitting another gear. Mm. That is so good. Well, folks, I hope you enjoyed my video. Get yourself some of these hot sauces. They're absolutely fantastic. Like I said before, the tapatio goes on anything. Chicken, you name it, you wanna put it in chilies, tacos, it'll spice everything up. This adobo loco, the pineapple hot sauce, got some good spice, can't be weak. If you use a lot of it, it's gonna burn you. But um, this stuff here just tastes like Maui in a jar, basically. As soon as you pour that on your chicken or, or even on pineapple itself, you wanna roast some pineapple on the barbecue, oh my God, so good. This baby here, um, it, in combination, actually, I kind of use all these in my chili because I want to spice it up just a little bit more. We get some more smoky flared butter, but uh, this baby here, the Aliak Takeo, definitely a go-to. you got to get some of that. This is going to be a little bit harder to find, but like I said before, uh, they have MaritimeMadness.com, right? right on the bottle there. So you can get right on there and you can order your Givener sauce, the ultimate giver sauce. Phew! You can get this baby at the Pepper Palace. This is a flashbang. It costs a little bit more for the for the toy there on the side, but uh, this stuff here is definitely a go-to. You want to be careful. Don't kill anybody with this. All right. Otherwise, Pepper Palace. If you're down in the Lower Mainland, you go down to uh, Sawasan. They actually have Pepper Palace down there, and you can get yourself some of that. All right. Thanks very much.